Europe is facing huge labor shortage and hence each European countries are hiring now. So today I'll cover Sweden because Sweden is facing a labor shortage in several industries. According to the Swedish Public Employment Service, there are 43,664 vacancies reported in the fourth quarter of 2021, an increase of 110% from the previous year. The following are some of the industries that are facing labor shortage in Sweden. Number one is healthcare. Sweden is facing a shortage of nurses, doctors, and other healthcare professionals. This is due to number of factors, including an aging population and an increase in demand for healthcare services. Number two, IT and engineering. Sweden is facing a shortage of IT professionals and engineers. This is due to country's strong economy and the growing demand for technology solutions. Number three is construction. Sweden is facing a shortage of construction workers. This is due to the country's booming construction industry and the aging workforce. Number four, logistic and transport. Sweden is facing a shortage of truck drivers, warehouse workers, and other logistic professionals. This is due to country's strong economy and the growing demand for goods and services. The labor shortage is having a negative impact on the Swedish economy. Businesses are struggling to find workers and are having to delay projects or hire foreign workers. The government is taking steps to address the labor shortage, such as increasing the number of apprenticeships and making it easier for foreign workers to come to Sweden. Yes, you heard that right. So if you're looking for a job in Sweden, you may have a good chance of finding a job in one of the industries which I mentioned now. However, it is important to be aware of the competition and to have the necessary skills and qualifications. So if you're looking to apply for jobs in Sweden, make sure to watch the video till the end as I'm going to share the list of companies who had sponsored Maximum Visa last year and also list of companies who are hiring now. Hello guys, I'm sorry and welcome to your knowledge buddy without any further delay let's begin with today's video so here are the list of those companies who sponsored maximum visa last year so that you can target those companies because they are more immigrant friendly and if they sponsored maximum visa last year chances are high that they will also sponsor again in this year number one is ericsson number two is volvo cars number three is astrazeneca number four is swansa number five is electrolex number six is h&m number seven is sandvik number eight is Microsoft, number 9 is Google and number 10 is IBM. Also other companies who were hiring in the last couple of months with visa sponsorship are Platform24, Think, MSD Surge, Events by L, Organon, True Color, Vestas, Forza, Cordit, Crimson Education, Do Wild, Prospect Healthcare which is recruitment agency, ATG and Hedvig AB. These companies are multinational corporations with presence in Sweden. They offer a variety of jobs in different fields including engineering, technology, healthcare and business and they don't mention the word visa sponsorship most of the time. So if you're looking for a job in Sweden with visa sponsorship, you can check the websites of these companies or contact them directly. But here are some of the best job sites in Sweden to find visa sponsorship for non-EU citizens like people from India, Pakistan, Sri Lanka, Nepal. Number one is LinkedIn where you can search for jobs by location, keyword and other criteria. Number two is Monster which is a general job board that lists thousands of jobs in Sweden. You can also create profile and upload your CV so that employers can find you. Number three is Stepstone, which is another popular job board in Sweden. It offers a variety of features such as the ability to save jobs, get email alerts and apply for jobs with one click. Number four is Erbet It's formerly DIN, which is the Swedish Public Employment Service. It lists a variety of jobs including some that offer visa sponsorship. And number five is Euros, which is a European portal that lists jobs in all 27 EU member states. You can search for jobs by location, keyword and other criteria. In addition to these job sites, you can also find visa sponsorship jobs by networking with people in your field, attending job fairs and contacting companies directly. Now, let's have a quick demo to see which companies are hiring now. So I'm going to show you demo through LinkedIn. What I have done in the job title, I had given the title name with visa sponsorship and the country I've selected Sweden. So I'll show you a demo for us. For example, this senior technical artist, just go and write here word visa. Here you will see visa sponsorship and relocation assistance is provided. So all the jobs which I have listed and saved here contains the word visa sponsorship. So you can also have a check. But also remember, not all the companies write this visa sponsorship. So if it's an MNC, definitely they will sponsor your visa. So very quickly, the name of the company is Sharmop. They are looking for senior technical artists. Next is one player mission. 
they are looking for senior technical artist. Moving to the next one, one player mission, they are looking for senior game designer. PWC is looking for Junioras Revoltia. UNSW is looking for professor, School of Information Systems and Technology Management. PWC is looking for transaction service manager. Mirai Talent Limited is looking for transaction services. Again, they are looking for transaction services, senior consultant. PWC is looking for so many jobs. So another one is senior tester. Another is transaction services, which is also financial due diligence. Again, PWC is looking for senior workday HCM lead consultant. The next company is Spotin. They are looking for senior front end developer. And PwC, again, looking for financial risk. So that's all about the demo. Before I wrap this video, here are some of the tips for finding visa sponsorship jobs in Sweden. Number one, tailor your CV and cover letter to the specific job you are applying for. Number two, highlight your skills and experience that are relevant to that job only. Number three, be persistent and don't give up. However, if you want to move Sweden without a job offer, make sure to watch this video. Thanks for watching my video till the end and I'll see you guys soon with my next video. Till then, keep learning. Good morning.